And now moving on to the next report, which will be made by our colleague from Bulgaria, Stanislav Stoyanov. He will speak about the updating of GIS of Sofia municipality using Ultracam XP images. Hello, dear colleagues. As it is announced in the conference document, the title of my paper is Updating GIS of Sofia Municipality Using Ultracam Images. I'll start with a little retrospection and back in 2001 when GIS Sofia made the first two experimental projects with 4.5 square kilometers total area. The aerial photography was made by analog camera with uh, 15 and 30 centimeters focal length. The received images are at scale of 1 to 4,500. The main purpose of this project was qualification, qualification the ability of the digital photogrammetry, in particular photo mode, for creation of an urban cadastral map of, at scale of 1 to 1,000. In 2006, started Vitushka Yaka project with area of 90 square kilometers. Also, analog camera was used, and again, the images were at scale of 1 to 4,500. The main purpose was to create an orthophoto plan at scale of 1 to 1,000 and DTM. All photogrammetric work was made by Photomod, and the achieved accuracy of the product was high. In 2008, was accomplished the biggest project for updating and retaining the orthophoto plans at scale of 1 to 1,000 and 1 to 2,000, and generating DTM for the needs of Sofia municipality. Hansa Wolfbuild was the executor, and the DMC aerial camera was used. The ground sample distance was 10 or 20 centimeters, depends on the urbanization. 10 centimeters for urban zone and 20 centimeters rural. Received were 6,912 images and organized in six blocks in photo mode. 131 ground control points and 31 checkpoints was used. Now we come to the essence of today's report, our photo flight uh, 2011, which we use for updating the auto photo plan and the digital elevation model of the municipality. Execution of the flight was made by the creation company Geophoto. <coughs> digital air camera Ultracam was used. The flight itself took four days and Let's go to the details. The total area of the project, 1,341 uh, square kilometers. According to the requirements of the project, the ground sample distance is 10 centimeters. The average fly height is 1,700. The average elevation over the sea level, 750 meters. The number of the taken images is 2,914 with forward overlap 60% and site 30%. Before execution of the project, 498 ground control points were pre-marked on the terrain. Their coordinates are determined by GPS receiver Topcon. You can see the accuracy. Here on this white, different types of ground control points marking. All the images are organized in three blocks, northern, central, and southern, for processing by photo mode 5.23. The projection center in the block adjustment are included, and automatic tie points were applied mainly, and manual were needed. On this slide, 
you can see the result uh, scheme of the air to angulation. The achieved accuracy of the adjusted block is 8.6 centimeters in position and uh, 10.1 in height. On this side, the tin. The tin uh, was built by semi-automatic way. We used uh, automatic points, back lines, and where needed, uh, we used uh, manual terrain points. About the counter lines visualization, depends on the project. The counter lines were built uh, automatically or manual if we need more precision. One of the end products of our flight, the digital elevation model of Sofia municipality. The entire territory is covered with them with uh, two meters cell size. Some socially and uh, important projects are realized using the images of this flight. One of them is Lesnowska River on this slide. We regularly update this project after every new flight. This time, the dikes were examined and uh, existing infractions were marked. With the uh, counter line was signalized the line of the previous flooding and uh, all the data is going to be used by the local authorities in order to make a prevention strategies against the, and plans against the food risk. On this slide, another very important and topical project. This is a project for fire protection in the forest areas. This one, we work together with the cartographic department. And the main purpose is to situate towers, <laughs> these red things, these towers we use and the authorities we use for um, for early warning in case of fire in the forest areas. Finally, but not uh, least, is the creating the auto-photo plan of Sofia municipality at a scale of one to 1,000. On the next few slides, you can see different parts and <coughs> objects of the new auto-photo plan. For example, this is an image of the previous one, 2008. You can see the difference. Before and after. This always from the new. We are taking an active part of the construction of the Sofia Underground Railway, Sofia Ring Road, and the construction of the Central Boulevard. Now, we are working on an atlas of Sofia municipality. It will be first of its kind, and will be at scale of one to 5,000. Uh, with the nomination of Sofia for a European capital of culture, our city was included in the European cultural calendar and established a good uniting course ahead of us. That's all. Thank you. Thank you very much. Any questions? Thank you for your report how long did it take to process data for the whole of the territory how long y yes 
Дайте подумать. Нет, отдельно, только обработка. Only processing. I'll ask the other questions later. Uh, any other questions? Oh, we do have a question. Uh, you did show the citation of uh, geophoto on the image. Uh, really, this aircraft was used for the aerial photography, the jet aircraft? I'm not sure about the plane. I think it's, uh, it's the, the Croatian company. I am yeah, I know that it's a Croatian company, but it was, it was interesting to see that for such relatively uh, uh, low altitude flight, you are using the jet aircraft. This plane on the image yeah. is a Cessna citation. Yeah, I know. Yes. That, that is my question. Was really this citation used for this aerial photography? I cannot be sure about this. Okay, thank you. When you say three months processing, that was done with the Ultramap software, right? From which version? Which version? I thought, Photomap version? No, no, the question is, was it Ultramap software or Ultramap? No, no, Ultramap software. Yeah. Was it Ultramap software? Again, please. Of course. The, the company executor. But I have to say the, the post processing of the images themselves was made by uh, the company executor in Sofia. They sent us a specialist who made uh, post processing of the images after the flight. Just to, to make it clear, after the flight with the uh, Ultracam, there is a software uh, Ultramap, uh, which, uh, which is used for the uh, processing of the images up to the level three. And then from the level three images, uh, you can start the, uh, uh, the real the processing, photogrammetric, stereophotogrammetric processing. So what you told three months, it's including the flight, uh, the processing uh, up to level three with the uh, Ultramap server, and then uh, the, the mapping and auto production with photo mode. Is I mean, it right? I mean that, yes. Okay. That's all the questions we have for now in the interest of time. Thank you very much.